Hi, I'm Amy and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to document some changes and plans that we had in our house for the month of December. If that's something that interests you, I'd love if you would hit that subscribe button and join the One Mommy Scrapping family. And now, let's get started. So the December 4th prompt has to do with changing plans and how they might be different than what we'd originally planned. And one of these pictures definitely goes along with that, and that is this, and I wrote about it in the journaling that uh, redesigning my scrapbook room in December was not on my to-do list by any stretch of the imagination. So I actually am pretty sure I already know how I want this page to come together. Um, the magnets are right here and right here, so I was originally going to put them on this side, but then once I remembered, hey, look for the magnets so you're not putting unnecessary layers on top of those, I realized that that would be better to flip them because of the um, size of this. And I've kind of gone back and forth going, do I want to glue down all the little individual tabs? And I decided no. They end up getting a little ruffled. I'm okay with that. Now I have two fours to choose from. And I think for this side, I'm going to do the sparkly one. Because, oh, I don't know. No, I want to do the sparkly one on this side because I didn't think that I could really get the... Um, floral branch to kind of really work. But I guess it could go there. No, I like it like that. So this four will go on the page with them. One of these days I'm going to remember to actually get <laughs> my tweezers before I start recording. Alright, this will go here. So the journaling for this says another thing not on my, I should have not in my plans, on my plans for this month, was redesigning my scrapbook room. Still, I'm so happy to finally have my new drawers. And I had purchased months ago the um, tall set of Alex drawers to kind of do a major redesign for my scrapbook room. Make sure I have that set right. There. And I didn't ink that one. I did ink that one, though. No, I didn't do this one. And my husband um, put them together because we needed the space in the living room because the water heater broke and we had to get rid of and move tons of stuff from the kitchen. So by necessity, I finally got my drawers put together. I'm not complaining, though. I am quite happy to have them together. Let's see here. I don't want my fat fingers in the way. Yep. Oh, you know what though? Helps if I remember to put the glue on the back. There we go. Hold that down. Okay. And then. I'm still going back, going, do I want to rewrite that? Not kind of do not on my in my plans there we go on my list or in my plans let's not combine on my plans and in my list that would be kind of silly okay this is actually part of this one I cut it off it was a lot bigger Glue that down. I really like these kinds of foliage types. Ah, let go. There we go. It's really easy just to tuck them in. I have a feeling as the book progresses, I will branch out in the colors that I'm using as well. So this is from the Vicki Booten. Um, Sticker book it says a beautiful sight, happy tonight, and I thought that would be absolutely perfect up there. There we go. And then I still want a little bit more over here. 
and it needs to be things that are flat because again this is going to be closed and if it's closed I don't want a lot of bulk I would like something green though could I fit in would that work that might actually work well there's also a tree which of course now I can't find no I don't want that okay I could put a snowflake in that looks a little silly though should have put it underneath that Oh well. Alright, so far. There's the green tree I was looking for. What do I think? I have to bring in some of that dark green though. Oh, uh, let's see what else. Where's that sticker book? Now that I have everything down, it's a little easier to kind of look through. Oh, this would work. And it kind of mimics the fact that I've got some greenery on that one. And then bringing in these stars to scatter about like confetti. That is one thing I am missing a lot doing a memory book like this is I'm not putting in certain pages like this don't get a lot of dimensional embellishments. So that means I'm not putting my Nouveau drops or enamel dots like I normally am. And that's just weird. <laughs> so small little things like that, that I can sprinkle around as the confetti will be quite nice. And I love that already. So yes, I'm going to ink the teeny tiny stars because I like that look. came up on a, a discussion the other day over at Two Peas Refugees on the message board and, and you know asking about what is it things that you'd like to see or embellishments you don't use something and somebody talked about how they didn't um, ink things anymore and I'm like oh my gosh I still ink everything well almost everything there was that, those couple little labels on it's the December 2nd page that didn't get inked. And I've been doing nothing but thinking about them going, could I peel them up and ink them? Is there a way I could get around that? I'm just like, really? <laughs> it's fine. All right. Okay. Those are done. And put that there. And I want to. Yeah, I like it right there. I want to include some of the stars on this page as well. Yeah, right there is good. how the parts of the star kind of you have a little part of the four just kind of sits in it all right and then the last one could I do right there could I go over here I think it's going to go right there. Kind of gives you a very long and narrow, acute triangle, but there, there, there. And then this kind of
kind of forms a triangular line. It's a little wonky, but you also get a triangle across the uh, pages. And that is very pleasing to the eye. Things in threes and in triangles in design. So there we are. We have the changes in plans here. And then celebrating plans I have not documented before in my Journal Your Christmas album. And I can still fill the magnet pulling a little bit there. So that is excellent. So if you enjoyed this video, I would love if you would leave a comment down below. Tell me something that you are doing differently or that you did differently in the month of December this year, whether it's due to the state of the world or not. And um, hit that like button because YouTube likes it when I get engagement there and that would help my channel out a lot. And I will see you guys later. I hope you all have a lovely day. Bye.